it's like Mark's car. The the RX7s uh, have those pop have those pop up headlights, and uh, after after 40 years of use, they still work. <laughs> it's like dang it, that's well built, and they still work perfectly. Like he has no problems with them; they just work. Do we have termites? No, thank goodness. Let's see, fatigue, stress, stress is a little high. Fatigue is okay, urine's getting a little bit high. Everything else is good. I'm not gonna smoke while I drive this car because I won't wreck it up. Looks like it's not already wrecked. <laughs> This is when the green car shows up. <laughs> there you go, Micah. You got your wish. Thanks. <laughs> Alright, here's the train crossing. Side of my car is all wet. I'm soaked. I can't look right now, John. I'm driving a car on dirt roads. I don't want to die. I don't want to die, John. I don't want to die. Where the heck is Flatari's? I am feeling very lost right now. And hopefully he's still open. The good news is everything's running good. The temps are holding. Uh, everything's everything's working as it should. I'm not having any issues with alignment. The brakes are working. The clutch is working. So we have a solid car. We just have a bashed up car. Oh man. Sorry. Oh, please be open. Please be open. It's hard to tell because it's so dark because of the rain. It's like... Alright, there we go. Oh, I drove this whole way with the engine choked. Oops. I forgot that you have to turn that off. I totally forgot. But that's why it sounded so bad, Micah. I had the car choked the whole time. All right. Oh, please be open. No! Oh, I hate you, Flatari. Ah, oh, dang it. He closes like at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. 16. He closes at 4. Unbelievable. Well. You know, the really scary thing is I didn't see our... our uh, when I drove down, I did not see our uh, exhaust pipe. Uh, what now? Man. I don't know what to do. I've got an idea. <sighs> well, we're gonna drive into town maybe? Where should I go? I'll just I guess I'll just go back home. Maybe we'll run into town, see what's up. <laughs> I'll probably pick up the van and get, uh, maybe try to find that piece. I'll just leave the car in town. Oh, make that 5-4. <laughs> Gaming nerfer. Do you have school in the morning, nerfer? Yeah, I'm going to take the show. Well, I'm going to get it going a little bit longer. Once, Actually, I can probably, yeah, I'll just I sat over too far. I can't tell if it's off. Hold on. Let me get over. Nope. I didn't want to exit driving mode. Okay. Well. Oh, I did get it in. So, okay. There we go. <laughs> I'm going to be all crooked. 
Oh, sorry, buddy. Now let's take it easy on the way in. Now, what's weird in the other cars, I can actually, I think I can switch if I remember right. I can switch out of the driving mode. There we go. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> yeah, you're going to have to watch what happened, right? <laughs> Let's see. Do Gem Guy came. I got a pretty good haul from that. Oh, the Gem Guy. There you go. You said you're done counting? <laughs> That BMW guy, welcome aboard. Unfortunately, this is not a BMW, it's a Datsun. And it's a squirrely Datsun at that. I am just praying to God that I don't run into that other dude. Not that it matters, because the car is all bashed to heck anyway. But I don't want to... I don't want to... I don't want to die. I should slow down, maybe. Yeah, this has been a long series getting to the point where the car's... I'm so excited, though. The car actually runs like a top, you know? All we have, the body's just all busted up. Busted. What's the matter, Violet? You get your feet wet? You get your green dress? Ah. I still have no idea what she said. <laughs> is the max speed I'm going to go along here, man. Wait, are you talking about in real life? Gaming there for what game? Yeah, the exhaust. <laughs> Plus, because my window's open. What's that? Okay, have her not do it. Help her not do it. Did Ryan get back yet or no? What? Is Ryan back yet or no? So he went on to Guitar Center then. Ryan's going to Guitar Center. He's trading. I love you too, Violet. He's trading in a drum set. Oh, in real life. Wow, that's cool. So you do some... Do you do mining, or what do you do? Do you do, uh... Like, rock collections? Oh, yeah. This car's doing pretty good, though. I mean, like, yeah, it's running great. It sounds terrible, but... Yeah, Russ is like, don't crash. Yeah, you're right. Seth is the voice of reason. Yep. What's wrong with the front? Yeah, I had a head on, uh, had a head on collision there and died. So, <laughs> but since I'm immortal, I came back, and 17 hours later, I'm driving the car again. It's a miracle, a very long miracle. But <laughs> what's up? What's up, Death? Death and I shook hands. Super Nooper is now online. And uh, he sent me back. Oh, that's right. That's right. I forgot that you did that. You did that in school, right? You said he, not we. He made some money. Oh, that's great. <laughs> you got the pan, and then he took the money. <laughs> We're in Pirajab. So the car is running great again. Just like I said, it's all bashed up. Uh, but I want to get the van and see if I can find the, the, the exhaust piece that I lost. Um, and uh, so we'll just park the car here until. Oh, wait, this isn't where I parked the van. Yeah, she turns great on the pavement, man. All right, turn the car off. My poor car. I love you, car. I'm sorry. So we'll get it fixed up. Uh, but we need to go find that part. And then get the... Get the Jones. Maybe we should tow the car home. We can take it all. This 
This could turn into a disaster. Let's try to make it not, but I think maybe I'm just going to tow the car home. Um, this is how bad ideas start. Uh, in the driving mode. Start the car. It's not like it's going to get any worse. <laughs> Famous last words, right? Oh, I have to wait for the worms up. I forgot. All right, we gotta wait. This car has the. Uh, let's see, he sent me back four dollars. Oh wow, that's crazy! So you get to keep it. Oh, that's cool. Hey, have a good night, Micah. We'll see ya. All right, there we go. Now we're ready. <laughs> this is how entertaining ideas start, right? Let's see, it's nighttime, it's raining, let's tow a car! That sounds like a great idea, with a van. <laughs> oh, you don't like the rain inside the car, huh? Yeah, I know, it's not super legit, is it? I don't want to do this. I don't want to give it too much of the way. It'll swing back and forth if I'm not careful. Oh! Alright, let's put it in park. Hop on out. Oh, I got a little too close. <laughs> let's jump ahead a little bit. Okay, back a little bit. Oh my gosh, this car is almost out of gas. You know what? Before we hook the car, the other car up, I'm gonna run over and get some get gas. Oops, this is not the right way. <laughs> you said you might want to get the car. Well, the van's—it's raining in the van too. So I'm driving around like a donkey with my door open. Oh, sorry. Oh, and wait—the gas is of course on the other side, so I'm coming in the wrong way. And parking brake on. I'm just gonna leave it running. What the heck, Lorenz, Lorenzo Melmida, Lorenzo Melmida. Welcome, on, welcome aboard my channel, my friend. Glad to have you as part of my Twitch stream. Diesel. Oh yeah, fill me up. This is the exciting part of the game. The thrills never end. Maybe this is not a good idea. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, I just thought about what I was doing. Why don't you fill me up, Buttercup? <laughs> yeah, I know he does get angry. Well, he might be a little angry because I just bashed his car with my car. <laughs> you can't see what I'm doing wrong. Right, I've actually heard that that does happen. Uh, uh, that you can't actually blow the gas station up. And so... There we go. That's <laughs> Smoking in the rain. It's safe because it's raining. Oh, did I tell you my car was still running while I was smoking and pumping gas? <laughs> my ex-wife smokes. It's so nasty. She freaking ruined my car. I, I am so mad. Ugh, I don't want to talk about it. She was already there. She's like, yeah, you know, the car smells really bad because I smoked. And is there any way that I can, you know, fix that? I'm like, nope. You pretty much ruined it. <laughs> It's like, yeah, maybe not have smoked in the car to start with. Yeah, I know, he goes crazy. Well, he just kind of goes crazy. He, like, drives around like crazy in town. Puff that pipe, dude. Come on. Oops. 
Alright, let's get in reverse here. It's hard to tell. This window doesn't really give me a good clear view of what's going on. That's probably good enough. Let's see what that what the damage is here. Grab the tow rope. Towing hook. There we go. Last swing on the cigarette here and toss it out. Throw it. Come on. There you go. Well, at least I'm clean. All right, so let's get out of here. Time to go home. With all of our, we have all of our stuff at home now, including the big truck. Though I think I kind of wanted to leave the big truck here, but whatever. Let's go for it. Let's do it. All right, so I'm trying to figure out the best route to get home. I think I'm going to kind of go the the road. Oh. So we got that, what is it, 5-5-1? Five, five and one? Is that the... Oops. Oh, come on, baby. Five, five, one. It's not so easy because you got the car to pull behind you. I've got the pedal to the metal. Oh. <laughs> uh oh. This might not work out. Well, other than fixing the car, then we need to start. We need to get past the inspection, do all the racing events, and we have to buy parts for it. So, we need to get all the racing parts. Come on, baby. Come on. You can do this. Oh, come on. I might have to just leave the car in town and see if we can't get any traction. This van needs a diff lock. There we go. Now we're moving. We are definitely going to stay off the dirt roads for as long as possible. This van has no... no uh, yeah, you gotta use the tanker truck to pull the car. I'm, the tanker truck's almost out of gas, so I gotta watch. You know what we could do? Uh, we could take this back to Flatari's, now that I think about it. And we'll just leave the car at Flatari's till we can get it fixed. So tomorrow... Oh! Uh-oh, I hit something. Make sure there's no parts lying on the ground. Okay, it's, it's all good. <laughs> this is gonna be the most dangerous episode ever. Arthur attempts to tow the car back to Flatari's. It was a very bad idea. Yeah, definitely, like, put the strain on the truck. You can't get out of first gear. Every time I go out of first gear, it, like, starts to stall. Well, this has certainly been an event-filled night, but I'm very happy that the car is at least running. Oh, man, she is all over the place. Oh... Stop it. Just drive straight. Looks like the window's broke. Oh no, it's just the graphics. <laughs> I did not get the 1070 installed yet, no. <laughs> you said replay night. <laughs> okay, I need to check. That car is going crazy. I need to check and see if the handbrake is on, because I feel like it's just... That should not be behaving like that. Hang on, let's see. That was a long... That's the longest I think I've been in a rainstorm in this game. Is the handbrake... Oh, yeah, of course, the handbrake is on. Oh, no, the seat came loose. Ooh, I was driving with a loose seat the whole time. At least it's moving around, though. Oh, my God, the seat was loose. <laughs> oh, Seth. Oh, snap. Okay. 
<laughs> oh, I got a death wish. Okay, so the handbrake was on. That's why the car was flailing all over the road. Uh, let me grab the toolkit here real quick, and we'll tighten that seat down, because when I get it to Flotari's, mm, I want it to be together. Nope, I don't want to open the boot lid. Yeah, at least the seat is working. Um, let's open this ratchet set up. Can we get the... Can I get the... Can I get the hand, please? No, nope, I guess not. I have to do it on the outside. F, and I think that's the right size already. Oh my gosh, don't do that to me, Carp. Say it ain't so. He probably is coming. Yeah, I forgot, working on, working on the roadside's a bad place to work because of the stupid green car. Yes, a lot of things went wrong. Yes, a lot of things went wrong. Um, it was... <laughs> I progressed very little since the last time you've watched. Um, and uh, yeah, lots of things went wrong. That's a good way to put it. Um, but things are going a little better now. <laughs> it's because I... Yeah, or the train. It's because I woke... It's because I was playing at like 1 o'clock in the morning and I really should have been in bed instead. I've made some really bad decisions, and they led to some really bad things happening. But I'm not going to spoil it if you haven't watched it. You'll just have to watch on YouTube. I have them up there. Maybe just as a gift for you, I'll release them tomorrow. We'll have to see. It'll be tomorrow morning, then you can watch them. Um, I try to get everything done and get caught up before I release the next or just stream, but I just have not been... Life's been too busy right now. I'm really busy with work, um, and which is good, except for I'm not getting paid by anybody, but... It's okay. I like to work for free. I love it. You said they were amazing decisions. Yeah, Carp was there for the whole thing and making fun of me the entire time. Uh-oh. Okay. <laughs> I'm, uh... I was, uh, surfboarding there. All right. I'm feeling like the... Ca there she is. Okay, she's pulling up next to me. Definitely easier to pull with that, uh... Oh. Easier to pull with the, uh... Oh no, the door popped open. Oh no! <laughs> this is not going well. No! Uh, handbrake, please. Where's the handbrake? Uh, okay. I was looking at my joystick. You said don't worry about it. <laughs> yeah, you'll like it. You'll laugh sort of hard and cry a little. Hopefully you'll cry a little because you'll feel bad for me. Close the freaking door. Come on. I can't close it because it's swinging. I want to make sure my toolkit didn't pop out. Nope, toolkit's still there. Gas is still there. All good. Open the door. <laughs> this is not my night. Yeah, I. Uh, yeah, it might have been. Uh, might have been one of those nights. <sighs> okay, let's see. Oh. All right, there we go. All I do is I don't want the black car to go down the side of that hill there. Ooh, Seth, there's a train coming through our backyard going real slow. Yeah, I'm just going to take it slow. We're almost there. I think this is it. Maybe? No. Oh, no, this is only the first turn on the entire super long journey that we have to make. That's great. I probably should shorten the length of the rope, but... We're just going to keep it in second gear and go slow. <laughs> oh, what a nice... I'm fatiguing out, too. That's not good. Oh, the door's open again! Oh, for crying out loud! Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I think... Well, the car's a little closer now. Hold on. Let me get it. I don't want to knock me over, but I want to get the car a little closer so the door stop popping open. All right. Mr. Car... Crap, I just I wanted to I want to settle behind me, not to the side. Ugh. This is like towing a car in real life. You need somebody usually when you tow cars like this you have somebody with you that sits in the other car. Okay. And we're gonna put the handbrake on. <laughs> Are you laughing at me or with me? Oop. I stalled. 
<sighs> There's two on the van. Nope. Okay. How am I going to do this? Oh, the whole shebang is sliding. I'm just going to... Oh, the door handle broke off this door. Well. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Everyone's laughing at me. I think it's kind of funny, too. Actually, I'm having fun. That's the whole point of this game, isn't it? Trials, tribulations, and fun. Enter in driving mode. Start the truck. Come on. Put your... Oh, my God. Foot on real brake. Take handbrake off. Put car in gear and... Yeah. Feather it. There we go. I think it might have hit a telephone pole. Yeah. I need to shorten that rope, but I can't do it on the uphill. I need to do it on the... Hey, have a good night, Fireblade. We'll see you next time. Uh, yeah, once I get the car to Flatari's and I get back home safely, I'm, I got to call it a night, too. But uh, I'm going to go real slow here, and hopefully the car... I need, to, I need the car to come back over this way. Because I need to get it when it's right behind me. Okay, braking, 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 braking. I'm trying to get her to, I'm trying to get her to roll up on me. Without pushing me over. All right, there we go. Okay. Okay, nice. Nice. Except for I forgot to put my foot on the clutch. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay, though. We can start the car again. Okay. That might be a little too close. <laughs> foot on brake. Foot on clutch. Push that in. Come on. Ah. I hate these parking brakes. I can never reach them. That's my biggest beef with this game. If there's anything that I could change in the game, it would be... What the heck was that, John? It would be it would be that the parking brake was, was easier to um, get. Okay, that's good right there. Are you excited about Mudrunner, Daddy? I am excited about Mudrunner, yes. Are you excited about Mudrunner? What's up, Straw? Crap, I just... See, that's as long as it was. Ah. Mm. What happens if I take the parking brake off? This is so hard to do. Forget it. We're just going to try to make it. Oh, it's in gear. <laughs> Enter driving mode. <laughs> Okay, so true story. Mark, my son Mark, okay, his friend Flowers, uh, I'm doing great, dude, by the way, um, had an accident with his Mustang. Uh-oh. My stream is, like, getting weird. Sorry. And my computer's going into crash mode. You guys seeing, are you guys seeing an okay, okay stream there, or is there other problems? Okay, it's running smooth now for me. Looks like you guys had a little chop there, but... Uh, anyway, um, so he took his Mustang. He crashed his Mustang. My my son's friend crashed the Mustang, and he took it. They they towed it like it was on a freeway. It was at night. They towed it, and they wanted to charge him like eight hundred dollars for the tow. And he's like, um, "Oh, that's a good point, Jay Crispy. I, you know, by this time though, we're almost there. Not quite, but just this long road here. Uh, but anyway, he so." They wanted eight hundred dollars to get the car out of impound, and he's like, "I can't afford that. Like, you got to be kidding me." Maybe it's a good thing I'm getting a new video card. <laughs> you should see it in just a minute. It is, it is streaming again. Let me know when it's back up, guys. Is it gone? Is it still? Is it starting up again? It should, it's saying it's streaming right now. Okay, you're back. Okay, good. It'll come back. Don't worry. I'll tell the story over again when everybody's back. The car is all over the place. He said, and we're back. Okay, people are starting to come back. So I'm going to pick up where I left off on the story. You got your dream dress? In real life or on the game? Oh, good, Violet. I'm so excited for you. Sorry, guys. I'm just going to... I need to check it on my end, too, to make sure it's working. There we go. It's live. Okay. Oh, no. Don't do that. All right. So. Oh. <laughs> oh. 
Oh. <laughs> oh. Story time with Arthur. I've got like four people back now. We're going to wait a couple more minutes. So anyway, here's this guy. His Mustang's in the in the in the tow the towing area, like the impound. It wasn't it wasn't the police impound, but it was like this towing impound. And they're like, you you have to pay six hundred dollars because it was raining and it was nighttime and it was the freeway, or eight hundred. I think it was eight hundred bucks was the total. Like it, it was like two fifty for this and like three hundred for that. And he was like, I I don't have that kind of. I'm twenty years old. I I barely can afford my apartment. I don't have that kind of money. And so they wouldn't give him the car back. And uh, but he's like, well. Can I at least, you know, uh, get some some of my stuff out of the car? And they're like, yeah, go ahead. So they let him back in. This is the best part. They, they let him back in, right? So he goes in to get the car. Mark's with him, right? My son's with him. And they get in the car, and he's like, dude, I wonder if it's going to start. And he's like, well, I mean, I guess you could try to start it, you know. And so he's th <laughs> he turns the car on. But, but, yeah, it was raining, and he had crappy tires, and he doesn't know how to drive because he's 20 years old. And uh, so he he shouldn't be driving a, a stick shift Mustang in the rain. Uh, and, and he hit, it was stupid too. He like hit a, a road, like one of those road construction signs. It was really dumb. Anyway, but the car was in gear when he started it. And so he started it and the car, it shot forward, crashed into the car that was parked next to it, pushed that car into a Jeep that was up on blocks and knocked it off of the blocks. And Mark, he, he just shuts the car off and... Mark was like, I can't believe that just happened. <laughs> and like, they were laughing. Of course, they were laughing, you know, but the guy was like, we got to get out of here. Like, let's just get our stuff and get out. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, he just left the car. They wanted to charge him to keep the car. He's like, well, I can't I'm not, I can't afford to take the car. They're like, well, if you want to just leave it with us, it's 250 And he was like, okay, I'll pay you. I'll get that to you. <laughs> so he just left the car. <laughs> Wow, mass destruction, right? Yeah, eight hundred dollars turned into much more. He didn't, you know, what? Are they, they knew they weren't going to get their money back after that, and he didn't mean to do it. It was a total accident, but it was just like, <laughs> could things get po possibly get any worse? Oh man! So now he has another Mustang, and he wrecked that one. I think if I, Mark, if I, Mark told her, if I, Mark told me right, I think he wrecked the new one. It was still a junky one. It's like you know, he buys like two thousand dollar cars, but. All right, so here's the Flatari drop, and then we're going to go home. I'm going to actually, let's see. No, I can just leave it here. So that worked out. Uh, I mean, it didn't work out well, but it worked out. We've got our car where I wanted it, and uh, maybe maybe not really worse for the wear. It doesn't look like anything really bad happened to it other than, let's see, my toolkit's still in there. Yep, toolkit's still in. Handbrake's off. We're gonna. He said, "Hi, Ferndale. I'm gonna push the car forward, like away from my van, and uh, yeah, uh, we had a little accident. You must have missed that one. If you missed last week, you missed quite an episode, <laughs> quite a long, drawn-out, horrible episode. Life is pain. <laughs> Oops, it's probably cold, huh?" You'll have to watch the YouTube episodes to see, but suffice it to say, the car's not in good shape right now. But it is running still. <laughs> Alright, so we are at Flatari's. Getting the car fixed. The good news is, mechanically, it's still sound. I stalled again, but that's okay, because we're here. Um, turn those lights off. go and I guess what's the point of locking it up because no one's gonna steal it <laughs> I was like, yeah it was a good one you know I'm impressed though at least the car still runs like a top and that's the important part um, but it's gonna cost me probably a butt ton of money to get it fixed I really need to get home because my guy is gonna die if I don't get home soon he's got thirsty hungry urine everything's going wrong I can pee wherever I want but let's get home Let's try to make it in one piece. Yeah, this thing tows it. It doesn't tow it very well, but it does tow it. But I should have made the rope shorter so that the car wasn't flying all over the place like that. Because that was a little rough. You said floor it. Well, 
You guys have seen what happened. I'm flooring it right now. It's about the most you can squeeze out of second gear. The van's really only supposed to go 80 kilometers an hour, though. You said a top that was broken half. Well, on the outside, yes. Pretty on the inside. That's the important thing, right? That's what the kids in there. Oh, oh, I can't read comments while I'm driving. Oh, no, he's not going to offer a discount anymore? Well, we better get this game finished before it goes out. <laughs> No train. No train. I think I've heard I've heard that too. He gives a pretty big discount right now. It's like 50%, so. Everyone start type no, don't. <laughs> don't type long comments, please. You can if you want. I just I won't read them. I probably will read them. Because I can't resist. It's like texting a driver. You know, they need. They really need to come up with a system where if a car is in motion, texts do not come through. Like, the phone shouldn't even ding. There should be nothing. Longest comment ever. There you go, game ever. I missed. Don't die. <laughs> Jeez. It's only 40%. Yeah, it is down. It used to be 50. Now it's 40. Should have slowed down more for that corner. I thought I could whip it, but the van just went straight, so not so much. I'll slow down more next time. I'm not very good in this van. So for some reason, though, I, the van with the clutch, I always feel right with. I don't ever stall the van. Well, except for like all the times when I'm towing stuff, but I feel very comfortable with the van's transmission. Oh, oh, just not the steering. It's a little. <laughs> Live on the edge much? I like to live on the edge. Was that loitering? No, the roads are not icy. They're dirty. They're dirt roads. So they're just loose gravel. That's what I was trying to do last time, but it didn't go so well. We're almost home. Listening for the train. Nothing. Oh! Erk! Did you guys see that? I saw it. I don't know if anyone else... I'm never going to find the handbrake. I don't know if you guys saw it, but... Um, we need to get out. Oh my gosh, it's dark. Crap. Um, I need to turn the car around. Okay, there goes the train. Yeah, if I get the van stuck out here, I'm screwed. And I might have just done that. Oh, no, I got the Jones. That's right. I can always come back and get it later, but we can get the van out. No. <laughs> Say it ain't gonna happen. Keep moving, man. Keep moving. Come on, we can do this. We can do this. There we go. All right, all right, baby. All right. There you go. This van puts up. This van takes a ton of abuse, man. Oh. All right, there we go. Did you see what I see? Did you see what I saw? A muffler. Actually, this exhaust system. Laying on the ground. Uh, how do I get out of it? I need to. What do you need to do? I need to put the handbrake on. There we go. Open the door, and I need to get out. If I can find my way back into the van, this will be good. Yeah, push the van. Ah, there she is. There she blows. My exhaust pipe. My missing exhaust pipe. I need that. I think it's in there. I have no idea. <laughs> I can't see a thing. It is pitch freaking black. Let's get home and not die, all right? Hopefully hopefully that's in the back. I think I got it, but I'm not sure, but that's all I can do. Handbrake off. It's so dark, it's scary. Yep. 
turn around. I'm going to try to turn around in a little bit better. <laughs> oh, yeah, it is almost time for Christmas music, isn't it? Like two more months or less. All right, let's do it. There we go. That's a little bit better of a turnaround there. And I suppose if it fell out again, we'd see it. So, yeah, look, there's... <laughs> Gaming never wants to hear the Christmas music so he can open up his farming sim package. Now the speed limit along here is 40. I think I'm already going 60, so I'll take it a little bit easy. But there actually is a flashlight, Crispy. I just left it at home. I forgot to bring it. As I am wont to do often, I forget to bring things that I need. Um, and usually I don't. I try to stay off the roads at nighttime because it is obviously harder to see. It doesn't look so great on YouTube or Twitch. And it's a little bit scary, but I need to get home and get to drink, eat, sleep, and call it a night. Farming sim style flashlight. Oh, what was that? Was that a beer bottle? I'm hoping that was a beer bottle. Oh, yeah, the red green book. Yeah. <laughs> you know, they probably did that on purpose so that you'd be like, oh. Oh, John. Okay, dude, you can't break my concentration like that, man. I'm trying not to die. I love you, John. John was giving me hugs. He said, I love you, Daddy! And, like, grabbed me around the middle and started patting my chest while I'm driving. I'm like, wait, no, I'm going to die! Ah, ah. This is advanced darkness. This is the darkness. I believe it! <laughs> What's up, Tracy? My my two year my my five year old son causing accidents. This is the darkness. I believe in a thing called love. Ooh. I love the darkness. They're just so silly. Distractions, distractions. <laughs> the hug of death. All right, come on, turn. Oh. There's all my food stuff. I can't see anything. Okay, there we go. Turn the ignition off. Put the handbrake on. We are safe at home. Thank goodness. Um, all right. So tomorrow we have to make it back to Flotari's, but what time is it? It's got to be super late. It's 1 o'clock in the morning. <sighs> My guy needs to drink and eat. Um, so I'm going to do that right now, and then we're going to go. i got to go pee. i got really got to go pee in real life, too. i got to pee. <laughs> Trying to end the stream as fast as possible. Uh, let's grab some food, because my guy's hungry. He's very hungry, actually. I'm going to need to get more groceries. Dang. I got home, and I got my my urine. Oh, my bladder's going to explode, both in real life and in game. Uh-oh. The sauna has turned off. You said water noise. Oh. I'm literally shaking my legs right now. <laughs> I should have plenty of money to fix the car. I think it's probably going to be... It's just body work that needs to be done, and then uh, the windshield. The windshield's 900 The body work's probably 2000 or 3000 but I've got nine, so I should be fine. Um, I need to release the urine. Yeah, I'm going to be doing this in real life soon, too. I don't want to... Kidney failure. Was it Star Trek? He's like, kidney failure? Good God, what is this, the Dark Ages? <laughs> Sleep. Sleep. All right, it is 9.30, folks. I am going to put this guy to bed, and then I'm going to go for a walk in real life and uh, lose some fat, hopefully a little bit anyway. I'm too big to jog, but I'm not too big to walk. Um, if you get dressed... I'm going for a long walk, John. You probably are going to tire out, dude. Where to where? Yeah, I'm going to water the lawn in real life here in a minute. Daddy? I'm going to go all the way up to the main road oh, and then back yeah. around, so it's about a 40-minute walk. Do you have to push in my stroller? No, I'm not going to push you in your stroller. You're five years old. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ta-da, what time did I wake up? Let's see. Um, you did it when I was at a noon. So we should have time right. next time we play... To get to Flotari's. That's going to be the first thing we're doing. We're just going to run right to Flotari's. Do it in, this, in my, the store. Even with the stress and dirtiness, we're going to leave I it. Asleep, then I'll 
I was stay the Oh, it's area. it's pitch black here too. I just don't. I go for walks at night because I'm fat Daddy. and I don't want to see people to see me in my shorts. <laughs> Seriously, I hate. Anyway, so anyway, guys, I am going to um, see you guys next time. Thank you so much for being part of the stream. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this episode. At least I didn't die, and we got the car rescued, and we're kind of now back in a better position than we were a couple of weeks ago. But I am going to have to definitely um, do some stuff over again. So peace out, guys, and we'll see you next time. Have a great night.